Occidental at Claremont Mud Scripps. Tigers without all Skyac quarterback Tommy Edwards. Freshman Brian Scott filling in, going deep. First play from scrimmage, Samuel Steckel drops what would have been a touchdown. That's all right, the Oxy Star receiver made up for it later in the drive. Look at this fade route, jumps up and over the defender for the catch and the touchdown. Brian Scott looking good. No nerves as a freshman right out of the gate, but it was still all Stags football at the beginning. This is Sean McCabney with a little screen pass to the wide receiver. Ryan Farney, nifty spin, 17-yard touchdown, 12-7. Later, same half, second quarter. McCabney rolls out, trying to buy time. He does just before the pressure gets there. That's Greg Wilson, wide open for a four-yard touchdown, 22-7. Tigers really picked it up in the second half. Takeaways were huge. Mueller breaks up the pass. Ball kicks up off the receiver's heel. That's Taron Mawinney. I don't think those offensive linemen are going to catch him. He crosses all the way over to the other side of the field. 42 yards on the opening possession of the second half for the Stags. Let's look at it again. Look at Mueller breaks up the pass. Ball does not hit the grass. And there's Taron Mawinney. Remember, Mueller had a pick six just last weekend. And then Grant Arnold on the run forces the fumble. The Tigers take it away. They're second of the second half on their way to 31 unanswered points. Here's Kwame Do. Wow, was he big time for the Tigers. 120 of his career high, 145 yards in the second half. Oxy up 24 to 22. And then Matthew Malos. This is the third takeaway. Look at him. He is moving down the sideline. Huge play to end the Stags drive. That was a 62-yard return, and it led to this. Brian Scott, little fake, left the option. Nope, keeping it, sneaking in the end zone for a four-yard run. 222 yards passing, 43 on the ground for Scott, and then Kwame Doe, have a day. Two touchdowns. Tigers win it 38-30. They move to 2-2. Two